Vamos a empezar Un party ale Vamos a empezar Un party ale Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel for those of you who are new, I am Miranda Marie. And for those of you who are returning, welcome back. I truly appreciate you joining me again. Today, I am going to do a clothing haul. Now, this was so last minute because I am still trying to get used to all of this. But I have a clothing haul from... Dun, 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 Shein. So... Unfortunately, I have already unpacked everything and have put everything on hangers. So I do apologize. Like I said, I'm new to this. I'm going to get better. I promise I'm going to get better. I'm just trying to find my rhythm, trying to find my flow. But I do have quite a bit of nice little treats here. Um, a lot of them are mainly like spring and summer clothing because I caught like a really, really, really good sale. And I'm all about a good sale, baby. Okay? All about a good sale. If I can save me a coin or five, we're going to save a coin or five or ten. Okay? <laughs> but most of them are summer and spring clothing. A lot of them I am using for motivation. If you watched my previous video, you understand that one of my biggest goals for 2022 is to get back fit, get back healthy, get back right, lose this weight that I've gained over this pandemic. And with doing so, I've learned in the past that when I buy stuff that I really, really like and I really, really want to wear, I'll get it like two sizes or three sizes smaller. So then that's going to make me work towards my goal. I've had success with it in the past. So if it's not broke, we're not going to fix it, okay? So with that being said, I am just going to hold up a couple items that I have here and I'll explain them to you the best way I can. Hopefully, I didn't snatch the tags off all of them, but if I did, my bad. Like I said, I'm still new to this. I'm going to get used to this. Just bear with your girl, okay? Just bear with your girl, okay? So the, the first outfit that I have it's actually a two-piece and this kind of goes I think this could probably go like fall winter it's this cute little two-piece sweater it's white and then it has the matching skirt to go with it I know that's probably kind of bright but it's super super cute it's not really it's not really really thick but it's not super thin either. It's literally just warm enough. And even if you wore it in the wintertime, you could probably get away with like some nice tights and some cute little booties or something like that. Um, in the fall, same thing. Um, it is kind of a crop top and it's short sleeve. The skirt, not too short, not too um, long. When I put it on, it came like just above my knee. So I think it gives a nice good little ratio of leg to show i got this in a a 1x so this is actually a size smaller than what i am now actually so not too bad um this other outfit another two piece and it's a tank and a skirt as well and it's super super cute it's kind of like a nude color and then if you look closely it has like the little um, actually that's the back, sorry. But if you look close, it kind of has like the little ribbing in the front, if you can see that. And again, not too long, not too short. Comes just above the knee. And then of course the tank is the same way. This is a crop top, but on the shirt you can see it a lot better with the ribbing. So I definitely love that it has that to it. I'm trying to also, I kept in mind that when I shopped, I wanted to get some things that I wouldn't normally usually wear. And I always complain about my arms because I feel like I have such fat arms. Like, I have such fat arms, which is totally different compared to when I was smaller. They were so toned and muscular. But now they're just, like, flapping away, flapping away. Um, Another outfit that I have is this cute little two-piece. It reminds me of me needing to be on an island somewhere. Oh, that was a zero. 
that was a size zero XL. So if you're familiar with Shein Curve, you know how they're zeros size. So that's definitely two sizes under what I currently wear now. Um, this next outfit is a 1XL. It's a curve two, and it's this cute little skirt, and it has like the little ruffles at the bottom. This is more like just below the knee, gives a cute little action there. And then we also have the little shirt, which ties, and I loved it because it has like the little flowy, um, dangly sides here, just to give it some definition. And then I love the tank again. I love the color. Like I said, it reminds me of like being on an island somewhere. And like I said, once again, I'm trying to step out of my my comfort zone, hence the tank top stripes. So that's one. And then another outfit that I have is actually a dress. This was actually supposed to be my birthday dress this year, but <laughs> No, it wasn't working. I was nowhere near where I wanted to be, so I was like, absolutely not. But it's this cute little dress, and it's red and sparkly, as you can see. And the reason why I picked this dress was because my birthday is July 4th, so red, white, and blue fireworks. And this just gave me, like, that feeling. Um, it has the little sleeves here, which you put off to the side. Of course, it has a little tie here that goes around your neck. And then you also have the covering for the front. And very cute, not very long. It's like a midi dress. It has a rouging on the side. So I was very disappointed I couldn't wear it, even though my friends was really trying to encourage me. But I'm the type of person, if I don't feel comfortable in it, I'm not going to wear it. So it was a no-go. We went with option number two, which turned out to still be the bomb. And I still had a great time in it. And I looked cute. Okay. So the next outfit that I have is actually um, this cute little pant outfit. Just something cute, simple. You know, you can wear it to the airport or, you know, out to brunch with your girls or something. But it's these cute little tan white leg kind of like linen pant. And it has like the waist and the side with the tie. This I got in a... 2XL and it runs pretty big so I was kind of glad about that I love a good wide leg pant I always have and then it just comes with like this simple little matching tank top which is super cute little ribbed I absolutely love this you could throw this on with some cute little casual slides or if you want to dress it up a little bit you could throw on some little heels so I thought this was super cute it can be sporty or it could be a little dressy so I really really like that and that's my style I love outfits where you can kind of use them have a, like a multi-use for them so you can dress them up you can make it sporty you can make it casual and go on about your business okay so the next outfit I have is another pant outfit super cute love the colors another pant outfit with the wide legs like I said I love a good pant with the wide leg and this I got in a, let me see, let me see. I received in a 0X. So this one is two sizes too big too. If you look, they kind of reminded me of like pajama pants. As you can see, they're super long, super wide. You can tell by the end of the pant there. Has the elastic band. And um, with that, it also comes with this cute little shirt and it has like a little tie in the front you have the sleeves but then you can either wear it up or you can wear it where it's kind of like off the shoulder so that's why i really loved about that it's kind of versatile with the wear and then if you felt like the stripes were too much you can always like having the stripes on the top and the bottom you can always take one of the colors from the pants and find like a tank top or a cute bodysuit to wear with the pants as well. And then with the shirt, you can wear it with like some cute blue jean shorts or some cute little white shorts or capris or a skirt. So outfits like this are like great pieces to have because like I said, you can multi-use them. You can use them for so many different things. It doesn't necessarily have to be, 
just for this outfit. You can use it for other outfits. Um, the next outfit is this cute little skirt outfit. Now, anyone who knows me knows I absolutely love, love, love purple. Purple is like my favorite color. So it is a cute little skirt outfit. And I thought this one was cute because it kind of has like the little sexy little side here when you put it on. And then it has like the rouging on the side. And then it also has a tie with a slit. So you can make it, the slit is high which it goes very high or has low as you want it. So I thought that was super cute. And then it also comes with the little shirt that's long sleeve. And it has the rouging in the front. You can't um, make this shorter or longer, which is perfectly fine because, you know, that's just me like... It, it, it just didn't bother me that it didn't come with the with the same option like the skirt did. But I think it's super, super cute. And this is something else that you could kind of like dress up or you could wear casual. You could throw some cute little sneakers or casual sneakers on with it. Or you could dress it up, put some heels on, make it a little bit more sexier. So just kind of depends on your taste. So that's another another outfit where it's you know it can be versatile but i just i love this color it's just so freaking pretty so pretty it reminds me of a homecoming dress i had when i was in high school it was like the same color almost um this next outfit oh and i got that in a 1xl so that was a 1xl this next outfit i got we kept oh and I just broke a hanger. It's wonderful. I got it because it was just super cute. Another nice little flowy pant outfit. I love the print. I love the fact that it has the elastic band. Um, I also love the fact that it does have a matching shirt with it, which is super cute. Um, again, it's a tank top, but it also has a ties, so you can like tie it around your waist. So I thought that was cute. And then another, like I said, another versatile item where, you know, you don't necessarily have to wear both pieces. You could pull a color from the pants, tank top, bodysuit, you know, whatever. Same with this, skirt, shorts, leggings, pants, like whatever you prefer to wear it with. I also liked it because it had a zipper in the back as well. So that was super, super cute. So I have to get a new hanger for that one because I totally just destroyed that one. I didn't mean to, but you know, being a little rough. <laughs> this one is a two piece. This is a zero XL. This was more so like um, for like interviews, um, business meetings, um, just different things that I know I'll have coming up and I need something that's a little bit more business casual. So I thought this was super cute. It's actually a two-piece. It is a skirt. I'm not going to take it apart, but it's a skirt with elastic waist. Pretty long skirt. It's like a midi-length midi skirt, and it's high-waisted. And then it also has the shirt that goes with it. Um, it's kind of not really a midriff, but it's a... Um, it's pretty high cut, but it still covers everything. So like, it's not like I'm going into a meeting showing my belly or anything. Plus the skirt is high waisted too. So you definitely have coverage. It's long sleeve. And I just thought this would be cute for like fall, winter. So you want some nice tights, cute little booties or some boots or something like that. Go on, go on, get your, go on, get your business handled. Um, this next outfit, just something simple. I got this in a... 1x and it's just another little pant wide leg flowy thin elastic band which i absolutely love absolutely absolutely love and then it also has the matching top to it and it's kind of um it's kind of it's like a mauve color which i love this color too because it's the form of pink so i think it's super super cute um i love how the sleeves are they're kind of rounded, if you will. If you can look at the side, you'll see how they just kind of round off. So 
I thought this was super cute. And this is something else you can kind of either dress it up or make it casual. I thought this would be cute for like a little um, like airport outfit or if I'm going to a brunch, you know, going to a cute little, cute little happy hour or something with my friends. And I just don't want to do something that's like just so out there, but just something kind of chill, low key. That's what that was for. Um, this next outfit is another two-piece. I love a good two-piece, honey, okay? And it's a skirt and a shirt. I did get this in a... Um, let me see. 1X. So this is a skirt with a cute little print to it. I thought that was super cute. And if you notice, the skirt isn't too long, not too short. It comes just above my knee. And then it just comes with a simple little um, simple little white shirt. And it's kind of midriff, but the skirt is a high waist. So you just you just give it a little bit of midriff, not too much. Not too much, not too much. Just enough. Just enough. And then the next outfit is something simple again. I just thought it would be a cute little um, outfit to have, little casual outfit to throw on. It's a polo shirt, and then it has a matching skirt to go with it. The skirt does come down to about mid-calf, and then, of course, you could just tie the shirt up, tuck the shirt in, however you want to do it. I just thought that would be cute with, like, some little Converse or casual little Steve Madden or something like that. Um, this next shirt, I love a cute white button up okay i just love them i love them i fell in love with this one because one it's a high low if you see how the high is in the front and then in the back it's so long and i love it because with this it would be cute to wear with like some shorts or some leggings and then i also love it because of how the sleeves are see how the sleeves kind of bellow out and then it just comes right here I just thought that was just super, super, super cute. And I loved it. And I got this in a 1XL. So you see a 1XL, how big this is. Love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> Absolutely love it. Um, the next outfit is a little blue outfit. And it's a skirt. Two-piece. I got this in a 2XL. Love this color. Purple, pinks, and blues, and greens, like this kind of color, like lighter shades, are so pretty to me. Like, when I saw this, it just reminded me of the ocean, and I love water. Like, I'm I'm a cancer sign, so you know I'm a water sign. This immediately reminded me of an ocean. <laughs> so, I just thought this would be super cute, especially, like, I just think this color blue looks so good on certain complexions, especially when they have, like, that nice, good tan tint to them to to them oh my god so pretty um it does come with the skirt the skirt is long and it has a slit for some reason it's like stuck in here and i don't know why but it is i do like the shirt because it kind of has like a little peekaboo right through here and it's like just enough to wear like with this I probably wouldn't wear a bra bra, but I would do a bralette because I feel like it has just enough peekaboo if you have the right bralette and then maybe like the right drop chain to go under it. This would be so freaking lit. So dope. So that's my goal with this one. Um, let's see. Do I have any? And then my last outfit, it was just a simple white t-shirt. And then it does come with a skirt. And this is just a t-shirt. Literally, a simple t-shirt. I got this in a 1XL. And then it does come with this skirt, which is a little long. And then if you can see, it has a little slit action right on up in there. It is thick, thick band. Like, if you can see how thick the band is on that. Thick band, which I love a good thick band because I feel like the thick bands tend not to roll and get all crazy on you. But absolutely, this is another one you can dress up, you can dress down. If you don't want to do a white t-shirt, you can find your cute um, bodysuit or a tank top or a bralette or 
whatever your little heart desires and go on about your business. But um, I just thought it was super cute. I'm trying to get my wardrobe better. My friends tease me all the time and they say I'm too conservative. But that's just me. It's always going to be me. I find sexiness in other ways. Some of this stuff is a little bit more risque than I'm used to and that I would usually grab. So I am trying to step out the box. But for the most part, honey, call me conservative if you want to. But that's just Miranda. And I still be cute with it. So I don't get no complaints. And the ones who do complain, it's definitely because I'm not your type. But... <laughs> Let me stop. But no, I was being serious. But let me stop for real. But that was my little mini sheet in haul. Next time I have a haul, I will try to remember so I can actually try the clothes on while I'm doing the haul. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, they had a really, really good sale. I think I got all these items for like, wow. I want to say probably under 120 And that's probably even including like taxes and shipping. Actually, no, shipping was free because that was a special. If it was over $100, you got free shipping. So, yeah. I really got some really good items. And I felt like I'm missing some items because I couldn't even remember. <laughs> I can't remember all the stuff that I received because, I, like I said, I start hanging stuff up, putting tags off. Some of the stuff I already wore. So, sorry. But this was my little mini sheet in haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Many more to come. <sighs> please comment below. Let me know which items you like. Tell me how you would rock some of these items. Tell me some of your favorite websites to shop off of. I know Shein is one of my favorite ones. Shein, Shein. I say Shein. It could, I, you know what I mean? It's one of the more popular sites here. But let me know below some of the websites that you guys like to shop at. Um, as of right now, this is one of my top fives. I always find some good stuff. I know some people say they have a hard time. But luckily for me, I can honestly say for all the years that I've shopped them, I've probably only had maybe four or five items that I was just like, okay, yeah, no. But that was also like my first first or second time ordering from them. But once I kind of got a hang of how their sizing and stuff was and I learned to like read reviews and look at pictures and try and gauge, you know, the people who left pictures compared to my body type and my size and everything like that, I started getting better for it. And one of the best rules that I ever learned, and it was actually from a YouTuber, and I believe if I'm not mistaken, I believe it was the Quana White. I absolutely love her. She is the bomb. She is so beautiful. She is just everything. But I remember her saying, as long as it's 5% elastic or more, get it. <laughs> she's like, whether it's your size or not, she's like, it can be two sizes down. But if it's at least 5% elastic or more, get it because you're going to be able to fit into it. And baby, ever since I heard that, that's the first thing I look at. First of all, is it elastic in it? Second of all, if so, what's the percentage of elastic on it? Because if it's 5% or more, I'm in there, okay? In there like swimwear. And it has not stared me wrong yet. Sometimes, depending on how it's made too, you may even be get you may you may be able to get um around three percent elastic or better, and it'll still fit. Because I know I got some three percent in there and it fit just right. Hug all these curves the right way, okay? But Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Please get active in the comments. I really appreciate y'all stepping. I really appreciate y'all stopping by, sorry, <laughs> to check out my channel and to check out my videos. It truly means the world to me. Like I said, I'm still learning, but we will get there. Please make sure you share this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you come back again. I'm Miranda Marie, and until next time, bye.